Boom shakalaka, Bitcoin on the verge of a breakout as recession levels have never been higher since the 1980s, where Bitcoin is likely headed next. Stay tuned. What's up, everyone? Randall here from Crypto Love. Today's video, a lot of very interesting charts for Bitcoin and cryptocurrencies, including an even higher probability of recession and where Bitcoin is likely headed despite that news before we get into it guys make sure to like subscribe click the notification bell come join us on twitter through crypto love push that like button now today fear and greed 54 neutral down significantly from yesterday even though the markets have just gone sideways today bitcoin at 3414 ethereum at 1848 tether at 99 cents bmb at 233 xrp 46 cents cardano 27 cents dogecoin 6 cents tron 7 cents and solana 1627 and the top coins today, based on AI, would be Cosmos Hub, Phantom, Seller Network, Reserve Risk, and Oasis Network. You too can use token metrics and AI to pick out the best coins. Free trial down in the description. Now, Bitcoin today sitting just above $30,000, just below this blue line, which would complete a many month long inverted head and shoulders. Bitcoin breaking through there could send the price to $60,000 for Bitcoin. But if you've noted, I put these bar patterns right here because if you take a look at the 50 and 100 day moving average, the green and the yellow line right here, the previous time that they crossed similarly to what they're going to do right now, a golden cross, Bitcoin price went from $22,000 to $30,000. If we just repeat that same exact bar pattern, look at exactly what it would do. And look at the resource support and resistance they would find almost exactly on these lines we already had pre-programmed on the map. So we could be seeing Bitcoin headed in that direction in the near future, especially with this golden cross as Bitcoin picks up momentum. But it looks like we're going to have a recession. News to anybody? No. But the probability of recession has skyrocketed levels last seen in the 1980s. Yikes, we're at an average of 62% chance of a recession by May 2024. Now that also means there's a 38% chance we're not going to have a recession by May of 2024. So it's kind of like two thirds to one third chance. However, you know what there's a 100% chance of? A halving happening roughly around that same time, May of 2024. We're 79% into the halving in progress to the halving. Now, 79% through before the second halving, look at this, Bitcoin price just went up the whole entire time. Now, before the third halving, Bitcoin price actually went sideways and or down. So which way it'll go this time, it's all up in the air. There's no way to tell. However, we are in the interim period pre-halving for 20 days, smoke them if you got them, or for 50 days this time. You'll notice what happens after that period. Massive gains for Bitcoin. So likely massive gains for Bitcoin to come. As a matter of fact, if you remember, pretty much every four years, Bitcoin has a terrible year. You just lived through it last year, 2022, and we're in for another three years of green. Thank goodness. Now, Bitcoin, one more proof, piece of evidence that the bottom is already in it and we're not likely headed down to $10,000 like all of the bears are talking about would be this right here, the total supply and loss held by long term holders. We can see that this drops significantly after the bottom has been reached, like we saw right here, and like we're seeing once again right now. There was a little bit of a difference during COVID, but that was again a black swan. So right now on the four hour charts, Bitcoin is forming a nice bullish pennant, potentially breakout headed in the near future. We need to fit, flip $30,500 for the bullish case. If so, then 32.5 could be the next stop. And it does appear like the wick off accumulation has been completed with low volume sell offs and then bouncing back. Bitcoin jumped to the creek two weeks ago and staying in a high position. It's entered the markup phase, bringing to a new all time high. So the wick off distribution has completed. Now we are headed towards higher highs. As a matter of fact, Bitcoin just completed a massive cup and handle with a breakout on the three day charts. Generally, this could also send Bitcoin much higher. And we see echoes of 2015 right here, one of the biggest bull runs for Bitcoin, where Bitcoin price did almost 100x. Bitcoin is broken out from the midline of the Gaussian channel right here on the two-week chart, copying what happened 
here in 2015 before we saw a massive rally. So big bull run coming soon. Where could we be headed? Well, it seems like Bitcoin hasn't been here before. Price bullishly explodes from lows, then it takes a pause at a range high and then continues to new yearly highs. Oh, wait, we've done this before twice, as a matter of fact, where we had strong bullish move, pause, and then increases. Again, strong bullish move, pause, and then increases. Well, we have strong bullish move, pause, increases, could put price in the interim, thirty-four dollars to $38,000. And that's just getting started. So if you enjoyed it, push the like button. I'll catch you guys later. Have a good one. Love you. Peace. If you don't think Bitcoin's going to a million dollars a coin and then $10 million a coin, you're already a loser. From now on, if you don't own Bitcoin, you're a moron.